Welcome back to Twine Game, where today we're going to play Eternal Sword M. Let's get started, shall we? Whoa. Swordsman. Mage. Ooh, pretty. Gunner. Warrior. Holy crap, he's OP. Miko. So attack and support is the main one. Just attack for this one. Just attack and almost AOE on this one. Interesting. What is Miko though? Healing. Healing. Well, that's the type I usually play, so it looks like I'm gonna be playing a Miko. Difficulty is only a two, though, so two star. See how the difficulty on these ones are higher? But my attack is maxed out on Miko. So is my support. Let's go to the next step. Oh, too bad I can't pick any of the other outfits. Whew, so pretty. Let me know in the comments down below what your favorite outfit is. I like this one here. Ooh boy, I'd be drooling for all those outfits. But we can actually change the color of the outfit, which is kind of nice. What if we did white outfit, purple accents. Completely white outfit. We can go dark and mysterious. I think I'll stick with that. Oh, I forgot to check the headgear. Dang it. World in ruins. It cannot be stopped. It could not be prevented. resurrected Lavista. The dark of all hope has been devoured. The world's hurdles towards destruction. It all happened in an instant. The giant magic that covered the sky, it swept through our homeland. Our losses were great. Allies fell one by one. Get over here! Save the world. All set. Let's go. Time reverse. Well, it looks like we're the last hope to save the world, and we have to go back in time to do it. This kind of reminds me of Xeno Sega, honestly. Not sure why. Seven days before the end of the world. That doesn't give us much time to save it. Oh my god. 2D perspective suitable for those sensitive to 3D or large battles. Target is always viewed sub for one versus one battle. My head aches. Indeed. Where is it? I can't remember anything. So this walking here, me walking like a flub, that was me. And this walking here is the computer doing it automatically. Automatically equipping. Automatically walking. I do, however, get to do the battle. Gotta protect this person, it looks like. Thank you. These goblins can't do any injury to me. May I ask your name? I can't remember. I think I lost my memories. Well, you should come with me then. Maybe one of my friends knows you. Do you remember your name? Girl, I just told you no. I scour my mind for a name that sounds familiar. 
Well, let's just flub one then. I'll pretend to be... Dwy... Sh Shin... To. No. Shino. Shino. Yeah, that sounds better. Not allowed. That's yes. Fine. Then just twy. Oh, that worked. You look tough. My character's on the run again. Looks like at the beginning it does all the running for us. Oh boy. Looks like attack stuff doesn't show up until the first time I hit the fan. Oh, here we go. Run, run me. Uh, holding down the button does not work. So make sure that you are tapping. Tap 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 tap. It automatically equipped for us. We're not quite at level seven though. Star, I got to use you in the end. <laughs> Ooh, question mark. Oh, battle! Who are you? Oh my god, they're attacking me! I gotta save that pet. He looks so adorable! I won't let you! You small fry. Now let's go save that cute, adorable little guy. Poor little thing, looks like it's dying. I can't just stand by and do nothing. I've gotta help it. Congratulations. Tap here. Okay. Memory journey. Well, that was a little anticlimactic. Looks like we have to recover memory. I don't like sheep either. I kill them. <laughs> Actually, goblin cuisine is pretty good. Ooh, goblin cuisine. Smells delicious. Look, it's waking up. It's so adorable. What is this guy? Am I supposed to attack him? Ooh. Yeah, I guess so. It's like he has a quest, but I'm just supposed to attack him. I am a mage. I shouldn't be fighting so close. Oh my god. Why do I run so slow? Oh my god. I'm like the turtle of all runners. Oh 
Level six, that wasn't too hard. My character sure does like to run by itself. I feel like aside from battles, this game doesn't really let me do much else. It does all the questing and stuff on its own almost. I'm not standing close enough when I press the fan, it just automatically gets me in the line of fire, which is really annoying. Alright, let's check out our skills. Click level up. It did it itself, but I want to do it. So it seems that uh, when you're in, a, when you click on their question marks, they automatically send you off on that quest. You don't really have a choice. At least I still got my battles. What the heck is going on? What is that? I can't go that way. This is the time rift. Looks like it activated because I awakened. Finally, something to kill. Let's get on. That was easy. Now here comes the hard part. Oh my god. He looks like that superhero. The blue one. I would read all those words, but it's going too fast.
star, you've changed back again. What are you talking about? I don't get it. You saved me two times now, Twy. You're definitely growing on me. Growing on you? Alrighty then. I mean, the walkthrough is not really too difficult, but it's a little... I feel like I'm missing some stuff still. this. Recall memory. Recall memory. Oh, another cinematic. It looks like... Nope. That was it. So I did play this game for like 30 minutes after this point, but it was still all the same. The character moves on their own. The character does its own stuff. And just left me to do the battling work. So I'm just going to cut the video off here. And thank you guys so much for watching. This is Twy in Game. Twy out.